Hi again, everybody. This is Rocky Wilson once again, and today is February 19th, 2020, Wednesday. And today's video is another one in my series of places and products I like. And this is places and products I like number two, Nassai Teriyaki. And I'm going to focus on one particular place today, Nassai Teriyaki at 145th and Lake City Way in Seattle, Washington. But it's at the corner of 145th and Lake City Way, and also at the corner of 145th and Bothell Way because that's where Lake City Way turns into Bothell Way. The reason I started this video was because I was on one of my favorite websites, which is Nextdoor. It's a website that's dedicated in connecting neighbors with one another. You know, so if you have a neighborhood issue that you want to talk with about your other neighbors, that's the place to go. At one point, they were talking about where's the best place to get teriyaki in our neighborhood. For those of you that don't know, I live in the Richmond Beach area of Shoreline, Washington. Nassai Teriyaki is about, oh, seven, eight miles. I guess it's seven miles away from my home and the area that I live in. But a lot of people recommended Nassai. And to be quite frank, if you were going to drive to Nassai from our location here, you'd have to pass a number of other teriyaki places to get there. And yet they recommended them. So what makes a good teriyaki place? And that's part of what this video is about. You know, basically teriyaki is salt and fat and sugar all the basic food groups, except maybe caffeine. And, you know, it's not necessarily healthy food. Nassai teriyaki on virtually all the rating sites gets top marks uh, compared to its competitors. And why does it do that? So what I did was I trotted my little rear end up there to just to see what it was. I remembered that I had been there about 20 or 30 years prior and I remembered it being good. I didn't remember exactly why. So I went up there and here's what I found. First thing is, it took a little time to get my, my meal. That's because they were in there heating it up actually on a stove or something. They weren't just popping something that they made the day before in a microwave or something like that. So the, the food was actually warm. It seemed a lot fresher. Um, the other thing that I noticed when I went in the door was that they, they were friendly. They smiled at me. They, they acknowledged my, my existence when I was standing at the counter. They said, we'll be with you in a minute. Uh, a lot of places don't do that these days. And they were extremely friendly. Everybody was smiling. The place was spotless. It was like the type of place you'd want to go to. Then I, they took my order, uh, and I believe it was the owner that took my order. It was, he was pleasant. He did it efficiently. First, I ordered my food and had some of it, and then I asked him if I could take a video of the place, and he consented. So you'll see that at the end of this video. Um, but the food is a little warmer. The place is a little cleaner. The atmosphere is a little more friendly, and that all just adds up to being a great place. You, you feel comfortable there. A lot of people that posted on Nextdoor knew the owners, knew, their, knew them by name. I don't. That's what makes a good teriyaki place is just a little bit better on a number of things. And by the way, uh, my portion size, the portion size was what I would consider enormous for a teriyaki place. They're, they're notorious for being big, but uh, this was big plus. And I highly recommend Nassai teriyaki. You, uh, one uh, piece of advice, though, if you're going there, it can only be reached if you're coming from the north on Bothell Way or if you're coming on 145th going east because of the way the the corner is. If you come up the wrong direction, you can't get in there because of the barricades in the, the highway and the barricades on 145th Street. 
Anyway, without further ado, I will go to the actual video of my experience at Nasai Teriyaki. Here we are at Nasai Teriyaki. And it's right in the corner here of this uh, shopping complex. And here's the front door right here with all the information. Nasai Teriyaki. Very good. If you're coming here, there's only two ways that you can come. If you come uh, south on Lake City Way or Bothell Way, you can turn into the parking lot. Or if you come uh, east on 145th, you can turn into it. If you come the other direction, you can't get here. Hi everybody, this is Rocky and it's February 6, 2020. I'm here at the closing hour of... Nessai Teriyaki. There's the information right there. Just had a great uh, meal here. Um, I will show you a little video of that. This is the entire place here. Not very big. And I will. And these are uh, some pictures of the owners. They look just like the owners right there. And here is their menu. If you're interested. I'll do a quick pan of the menu. And I had the teriyaki uh, chicken and beef combo, which is uh, number C2 right over here. Well, I cut off the other video, so here's the menu, and I'll go down slowly. I had C2 there, the chicken and beef. And here's some more over here. Very good. And again, it's Rocky Wilson. And it's February 6, 2020. And there's the size of the entree. And it's pretty large. <laughs> 